Hello guys, good morning. Welcome to today's office. I just thought I would pick up the camera and film whatever happens today. I just had a feeling that today is going to be a fun day for no reason whatsoever. I was supposed to be training with Ella and Chelsea this morning, but they can't make it. So I'm like, oh no, I have to train by myself, which low key, like that's fine. I, I can do it. But I'm just also like, <laughs> I love seeing my friends in the morning. I'm like, I don't even get to see them, but that's okay. This is literally what I do before I get to the gym. I'll sit and watch like YouTube for a good 15 minutes while I drink my pre-workout. So I'm just watching Soph's vlog. Also, love this um, setup going on here. Why not? And also doing emails in the car while I hype myself up. This is like multitasking to the max. Just don't know what it feel like. Like, do I want to do hit? Do I want to do... Like a weights, maybe a weight session. I just don't know. Full body hit. Jesus. I have been sitting here for five minutes trying to decide what I wanted to do, but I've decided to do full body toning. <laughs> done that was so good I trained for just over an hour in the end because I did a bit of a yoga flow and then I practiced handstands for ages considering I was going into it feeling really unmotivated I was like I'm just training on my own feeling sorry for myself I actually had a really good session and it was so much fun just to like listen to good music I don't think I'll go to the post office today but I think I might go and get a d-bowl I'm really feeling like that I haven't had one in so long it's actually ridiculous I've got my d-bowl and I ended up driving to the beach because I just got really anxious. I picked up my D-Bowl and then I went and sat in the car outside of D-Bowls so that I could eat it, right? And then someone tried to indicate into my car park spot so I just got really nervous and I was like, well, I have to go. I just came and sat here where no one is going to indicate into my spot and also no one is going to be walking past being like, what the is this girl doing sitting in a car like a loser eating an acai bowl? and talking to a camera. It has been a hot minute since I've had a D-Bowl. It's honestly been forever. I parked here so people wouldn't walk past and they still walk past. Also, can I just remind you that mixing is the best way to go. Where is my granola? Hello, I am home now and I've obviously done my makeup. I'm so happy that that is done. I'm gonna be filming another monthly favorites video, which I'm not sure if that one will be up first or this video. So here is a little 
sneaky peek into some of the products that I'm going to show. I wanted to base this monthly favorites around health based products that I'm really liking because I thought I could put a little bit of a theme on it. Anyway, so I'm going to go and film that one. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> Hello. I'm gonna keep she, she doesn't and... even like Hey, me. this is literally what you just did. <laughs> no, I did not. You did. No, this no, is no, what no. I see every day. <laughs> <laughs> that was like an egg. And this is what I see every day. <laughs> it's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Jeez, humble brag. <laughs> Geordie is home. Yay. This is like the first vlog in ages that Geordie's been home at lunchtime. Yeah, but it's Friday. How good. Geordie finishes early on a Friday. So I'm going to have some lunch now. I don't know what I'm going to have. Geordie's got a, a vocal coach uh, now. So he's going to go to that this afternoon. And we're going to babysit his nephew tonight. Yeah. Little Finny Finn. Finny Finn. We're going to get takeaway as well. We're going to get Thai takeaway, which is going to be really fun. Served. Geordie's already eaten his, but I've just got my quinoa tuna bowl going on. I was just gonna say I've been loving the tuna train. Um, this is huge as well, and also putting corn chips in it. So That's good, crunchy, delicious, delicious. <laughs> Geordie and I um, started watching SA. Classy, boozy, delicious, delicious, <laughs> Sassy, moody. Delicious. Jordy and I have been watching SAS as of last night, so we've just got it up on the poodle. We're gonna watch it. Shelby, what's her name? Shelby. Chappelle Corby's Shelby. getting. <laughs> Shelby Corby's getting interrogated, so this is the juicy, juicy stuff. <laughs> guys a little bit of an update Jordy and I are actually in Jordy's sister's apartment because we're looking after um, Finn so Jordy's little nephew so he's just gone to bed we have gotten some Thai takeaway for dinner tonight and we're just gonna sit down enjoy our Thai this is like a special treat every time we come to Jordy's sister's house it's amazing I'm so so I, I didn't know how much I felt like it until I've seen and it. And magnums as well. Jordy got dairy free magnums. I'm so excited. And mm. we've obviously got S E S I can see it's S E S. It's S A S. Monday. I'm sorry I didn't really pick up the camera all that much this morning, but I did 5.30 club as usual and also did a sweaty hit session this morning. I was absolutely drenched. It was horrible. Like it was great once it was done, but during I was like, holy this is hard, but I've just gotten home. I had a shower, did my makeup so that I looked a little bit presentable because today, oh, you can see me. Hi girl. 
I'm about to show you what this mess is. Pretty much, Riderwear's Black Friday sale is going live. It's probably already live by the time that this vlog is up, but I'm filming a video putting on all of my favorite Riderwear outfits and showing you guys what is gonna be on sale. So hopefully when this vlog goes up, you can still shop the sale, but um, my code is jessie10 if you do get anything from the Black Friday sale, but I'll show you quickly because this is going to be a totally separate video of me just trying on all my favorite things. But I've just lined everything up so I can start here and work my way through each collection. And I think some of the items are going to be like 60 to 70% off or something like that. So absolutely crazy and I'm very excited. If the Ride Away haul is already up on my channel by the time this goes up, I'll pop it up here so you guys can go and watch that one and shop the sale if you want. I also just found out that these are going to be 50% off and these are my favorite at the moment so I am so excited for that one. But yeah, I'm going to get on to filming now because I presume this is going to take me like two hours to film. I don't know when the last time I vlogged was but we're rushing off now because Jordy and I are gonna go to a home open or an apartment inspection. One of my friends is the real estate agent for. We are running late because we packed our bags so we could go for an ocean swim afterwards. Kind of logged off from work for the day because we're gonna go to the inspection, go for a swim, and then we'll go back to our friends before. Oh, food. I brought it. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, I didn't even think about it. We're going to Sam and Bond's after and we're going to eat our dinner there before Geordie's soccer game. So this will be fun. You guys yeah, get to come and watch um, Geordie's soccer, which I haven't actually vlogged before. So excited to see this apartment. I think it'll look really nice. We're not really in a rush to get out of our current apartment. We're just kind of keeping our eyes open. It's like a one bedroom study. Uh, pet friendly. How perfect is that? So we're just gonna have a little look, suss it out, and I'll take you guys along. Hopefully I can film in there. I mean, my friend, her name is Alyssa. I'm sure she'll uh, let me. <laughs> hey girl, this is my friend Alyssa. You've seen her in like all of my vlogs before at 5.30 Club. Cute little study nook. This already feels way more spacious because there's so much light coming in. Hey. <gasps> Oh, this is nice. Cute. What the heck? Look at that view. Laundry in here. Very nice. Beautiful bathroom. This is so nice. Bedroom. This is. Wait, can you actually. Are you allowed to cook up here? Yeah. What? You're actually kidding me. <laughs> I think this is the best place I've ever been to. It's so good. It's so worth it. Oh no, I said to Jordi, I was like, oh, we're just going to look. <laughs> and I'm like, here we go. The boys oh. warming, up, warming up. Yeah, the boys. Soccer mom. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> oh, a handsome seat pins. <gasps> Good morning everyone, happy Tuesday. I've just made myself a pre-workout and this is an exciting pre-workout that I never have anymore. This is actually the original strawberry one. The strawberry pre-workout was reformulated, but I was such a fan of the old one, not gonna lie. And so I kept another package of the old one that I use occasionally, so I like. Don't feel like I'm missing out. And it is so good. I feel like I was the only one who was obsessed with it. All of my friends were like, nah, prefer the, the new one way better. And I'm like, true, it is really good. The OG, there's something about it. I just love it. Like sometimes I forget what it tastes like. And so it's always exciting when I try it again. I'm like, oh, that's it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so many mems from it. I just like, oh, I loved it so much. I'm the sort of person who associates smells and tastes with really good memories and this to me is just such a good 
memory. I think it just reminds me of like the start of this year before COVID hit and yeah, just moving here and then like starting 5.30 club and then when Soph was here, just like all the happy times, you know? I met new friends. This, this just tastes like a good time. I didn't go to 5.30 club because I couldn't be bothered. <laughs> um, I know that's not a good enough excuse, but that's literally what I said to Jordy this morning. I was like, mm, nah, can't be bothered. So I'm still up early and I just get to see the sunrise, which is even better. But I'm going to go and train with Ella now. I think we're doing arms today, which is very exciting. And I need all the hyping up I can get. <laughs> the worst vlogger ever today was just a hectic day so if I'm honest I completely forgot I was doing a weekly vlog so I thought I would sit down and catch up with you it is nearly 8 p.m. I've just finished cooking dinner so that when Geordie comes home we can eat together I've made a um, like pesto gnocchi so <laughs> it was pretty easy but I really hope it tastes good. This whole day I have been editing my Rider Wear Black Friday haul video, which you guys would have already seen. It just took way longer than anticipated because it is like a 20, I think it's like 22 minutes or something. So yeah, it was super long, but we got there in the end. I also recorded a podcast interview with my beautiful friend Madeline Carafa. She is the host of the Healthy Hustlers podcast, and so we chatted all things healthy habits, routine, mindset, everything like that. So it was a really good chat, and if it's not out already, it'll be out very soon, and I can't wait for you guys to hear this conversation. It's so much fun, but apart from that, Jordi and I have been grocery shopping, and that is all. It's just, honestly just been a computer editing uh, sort of day, so not really like fun vlog things that you want to see but hopefully tomorrow is a little bit more fun in saying that though no actually it's probably not gonna be <laughs> yeah I think like just prepping for the right away sale which is the biggest sale of the year obviously Black Friday is huge in businesses and especially right away and because I do work for right away um, as one of their athletes I want to make sure that they are getting the most out of their sale and I'm doing my part to spread the word about the sale and everything like that so I am putting in a lot of effort this is how the pesto is looking why is it bubbling so much oh she is a bit stuck to the bottom it just looks it's like green soup with potatoes in it. Gross. Wow, it tastes really good. <laughs> Hi guys, I don't think I've actually started today's part of the vlog. Um, it is like 2 p.m. This whole morning I've just been doing right away stuff because the sale went live this morning. It's going really well. Also, my skin is having a moment today. I've just had a bit of a late lunch because I wanted to eat before I do my nutrition lecture. I don't know if anyone else is like this. It's like watching a cooking show when you're hungry. It is never, ever, ever a good time because then you go and like get snacks and la la la. So I like to watch my lectures on a full stomach because then I'm not constantly thinking about food. I can actually focus on what the lecturer is saying. So handy tip if anyone is studying nutrition or dietetics, definitely eat before your lectures or before your tutorial. So also today I've kind of dedicated the day to working on my little project that I'm doing. I thought I would start talking about it a little bit more as it's so close to finishing and I want to give you guys, I guess like a bit more of an insight into what's going on and get you excited about it as well. And I just figured if you'd made it this far in the vlog, you obviously like care about my vlogs and supporting me and everything like that. So I feel like you guys deserve to know. So here's a little sneaky clue is that I have to pass my last exam before I can release this thing. 
Hence why it has taken me so long to get it out is because I want to be qualified before I can share it onto you guys. There we go. Also, on a totally different note, I didn't show you how my pottery turned out from the weekend. So I wanted to show you because it is all dried now. So I ended up also making a little cheese this is going to be like a little cheese board but the texture that i've done on it is like a floral sort of thing this is where i stash my pottery i also did another um orange juicer or a lime or a lemon juicer because i've never seen anyone do these before and i wanted to make like an original thing so that is very cool I also made this mug. I really wanted to do a funky handle on this, so we'll see how that goes once it's fired. And then I also made a little tea leaf strainer, so this can sit over the top of whoever gets it for Christmas's mug, and then they can strain the leaves. So, super, super cute. Anyway, but the collection is looking pretty good. I'm finished with all the clay that I originally bought. I've ordered a glaze so I can glaze them and then fire them. I'm gonna go and do my lecture now, which is gonna be so much fun. I think it's on like diabetes and cancer. We'll soon find out, but that is the plan. Hello, my lecture is done. I'm delusional. It's actually getting quite late. I think it's like 6 or 7 o'clock. I don't even know, but I'm gonna start cooking dinner and tonight I'm gonna make a fish style curry, but with tofu because we need to use the tofu ASAP. So I'm gonna do a fish curry without the fish. Soph and I are currently, we do this thing, I feel like, we don't FaceTime just in case like one of us is busy, but we'll send 10 million videos to one another. <laughs> we do, I do this with all of my friends, but especially Soph, because like we both, you know, we miss each other. Like one of us will be doing something and la la la. So we just send each other vlogs. And at the moment I've just sent her one because I was asking for her opinion on like management and stuff like that because if I'm honest I'm getting to the point where I'm a little bit like I need some help <laughs> so that's what I'm asking her about um, I'm just having a little look <laughs> I'll wait for them all to come through because they'll be about 40 it's like watching a YouTube vlog while I'm cooking really but I'm gonna get on to making some dinner hey girl I don't know how it is. A mini heart attack because I didn't know where my camera was I had the tripod but I couldn't find the actual vlogging camera and I was like oh, I've left it like literally on shoot or something also oh my gosh I accidentally overtoned my hair last night with the purple shampoo and it's come out like this really cool platinum gray sort of color look not complaining about it but like do you reckon? So I finished up the content morning with the girls. We got a few different looks just for some upcoming posts that we wanted to do. Now I've got a proper photo shoot, like an actual one this afternoon. That is my lunch ready. But I shoot for one of my clients in e-commerce. I think it's only a couple of hours today, but we get through so many outfits. It's ridiculous. So I'm just going to leave this makeup on um, so that I can just jump straight into shooting. I'm having leftovers from last night. So you would have seen me make the tofu 
curry like it's a fish curry but instead of fish we've got tofu so that's really yummy i've also got two pieces of sourdough to have with that one because i love sourdough i do get questions a lot about like how i eat before shoots and i don't know I really don't change anything because I don't really care. <laughs> I think if I was doing like a bikini shoot, I'd want to make sure like I look fit and all that and don't eat like a chocolate cake beforehand. I eat relatively well like every day anyway, so I feel like I don't have to change anything before a shoot, if you know what I mean. Hello guys, I've just gotten back from my photo shoot and I've realized I've forgotten to hang out yesterday's washing. This is huge. So instead of accepting the fact that I'm an adult, I am gonna do an unboxing because that is so much more fun than hanging out the washing. But I got a package from Pepico, who a few of my friends um, have worked with and they are obsessed. So my expectations are all the way up here. I'm so excited. Look, I have tried one of these LED masks before and I don't know how I feel about it. So like, I'll give it a go, but if I don't like it, I won't share it. Don't worry. Ella has said this like sleeping mask, which I think is this one, this sleeping mask is supposed to be a gift from the gods. So I'm very excited to try the sleeping mask. And also Soph said she really liked this cleanser. So I'm gonna try that one. And then also, this is exactly what I need in my life. This is like a cleansing egg or cleansing device. After watching skincare by Hiram, I watched like literally one video and I was like, yep, I'm influenced. So he said, if you can give up using makeup wipes because it's so bad for the planet. And I was like, oh my gosh, okay, I will. So I've decided to get one of these cleansing devices so that I don't have to use makeup wipes and I can just like clear my face and then jump in the shower because I always like taking my makeup off before I get in the shower. Oh my gosh. <gasps> I just plunks in there. Oh my God, amazing. Me, 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 me. I'll keep you guys updated with how I go with these ones because I'm gonna start using them tonight, I reckon. Oh, yay, I'm so excited. Hello guys, I am editing this vlog that you just watched and I wanted to jump in at the end because I forgot to film an outro again. If you liked this video, please go down and give me a thumbs up down below. If you made it this far, you are an OG. Thank you so much, I really appreciate it. If you aren't already, please do subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss when I upload. My name is Jess, I make new videos every three days, so I'll see you in three days.